I've also got my water line laid out. You can see the roll way back there. Yeah, there's the roll. So I have the water line out here, and it's going to be going into this trench, which I have prepared for the water line. And I've laid two inches of sand along where I'm going to put the water. And here's a culvert. And I'm also going to maybe run the, the sewer line over top of this. So by code it has to be sheathed. And I figured sheathing it underneath this culvert would be a good idea too. And then up around the corner with sand. More sand along the side. Again, where the water, water line is going to go. And then the end of the pipe is right there. And now I have the water line run. In installing the pipe, I also installed this pressure gauge with a cap on the other end to make sure it retains pressure. Now I filled it up to 80 PSI and it fluctuates between what it is now, like 75 and like 85, because half of this coil is outside and if it heats up, that adds pressure. And right now it's morning and cold, so it's lower pressure. So I'll just leave this attached so I can monitor the pressure during the entire installation process. Of course it rains for one night and the trench is filled with water. Luckily the, uh, the water company said that they don't have to inspect this, neither does the township, so I can cover this up now. <laughs> 